Kevin from Hopefully Diagnostics. This video, we're going to go through and show you how to do the DEF system pressure test uh, using the JAL test software. Uh, for this one, we're going to actually use the, uh, the Cummins X15 as an example. Um, Cummins has all those DEF um, or all the after treatment functions built into their control module on the engine. Uh, other manufacturers, for example, Freightliner, they're going to have uh, probably an, a, a separate controller, an after treatment controller uh, that handles most of this stuff. So uh, for this example, for the, the leak test, we're going to use a, a Cummins and then we're going to have a follow up video to this uh, that's going to walk us through the um, walk you through how to do the uh, flow test or the pump test uh, using a, a, a Detroit or a Freightliner uh, module. So um, we'll go ahead and get connected here to this Cummins X15. Uh, you are going to find the, uh, the DEF testing under the system checks heading uh, in the dashboard here. So once we once we get connected, uh, we're going to go over to system checks. Now, uh, there are some modules where we'll have act component actuate or actuate components is where you will find for example, the heater test, okay? So it is possible you might have some functions uh, under the actuate components um, tab, whereas usually they're gonna be found under that system check. So you might have to check in both, or you can take advantage of our search function. So in the, in the top bar here, type in uh, the DEF, and that narrows down everything to DEF system checks, okay? So under system checks, uh, at the very bottom here, you'll see add blue DEF, um, and the DEF, pump test that's going to be we're going to do that in a later video uh, that's going to be the flow test and um, it gives us an opportunity to see the characteristics of the injection um, for this example on the cummins let's go through and do a, a leak control test or or leak test so if i highlight the leak test uh, it's going to access the, the the leak test criteria so it's going to tell us here that it's going to be 130 psi maximum of 20 minutes just like you would find using the uh, uh, the insight tool um, go ahead and hit the check mark. It's going to make sure that we're, you know, meeting the requirements for engine speed. Uh, in this case, simulator, not going to be accurate, but once you get that zero RPM, the engine is stopped. Uh, you should see the check mark there. Uh, move on to the next, uh, the next section here, the check mark, and we're going to be able to see our DEF pressure. Um, we're going to see the state of the test um, and how long it's been running. So again, this is a simulator, so we're not, we don't have accurate information here, but um, this is, uh, this is the flow uh, of accessing this test. Now, if you wanted to, um, again, that graphing button is available. So just like in our data monitoring uh, video, where we showed you, you can graph this data um, here, it's going to graph our, our DEF pressure. Okay. So if you want to monitor that DEF pressure while it's, uh, while it's in, in operation, uh, feel free. Uh, there's a, there's an option for, um, viewing that in a graph form, or you can just you know, watch the value here. Um, once you're done or, or once it times out after that 20 minutes, go ahead and hit the check mark. And then it's going to take you right back to that, um, that, that, uh, the main screen, um, the diagnostic dashboard. Um, now it does mention that, Hey, we, we did create a graph. Would you like to see it? Would you like to display the results? Um, and in this case, we're going to say no. Uh, but, um, yeah, you can always view that data after, after we're going to have a snapshot of that test, you know, what happened, we can add it to our diagnostic report, um, and then have a, have a copy of the results of that test, um, on our diagnostic report as well. Okay, so that is the uh, the leak test, DEF system leak test on an X15 Cummins. Um, we are going to follow up. Uh, the next video is going to be on the DEF uh, flow test or pump test, whatever you would like to call it. Um, and we're actually going to use a different vehicle as an example for that. So again, um, if you have any suggestions at all or you uh, you have any questions, uh, definitely hit us up in the chat below um, and uh, make sure you subscribe. We'll have plenty more videos, tutorial videos coming out on the JAL test software. Um, and uh, we hope to get more and more in depth as, as time goes on here. So uh, make sure you give us a follow and uh, we'll, we'll, we'll see you next time.